Hello guys, this is Vivek and this is the 17th tutorial of this Linux tutorial series. In the last tutorial, we saw how we can add new users and create their passwords uh, or set their passwords. So in this tutorial, we are going to learn more about that and we will see how we can add groups and how we can modify uh, users or groups. So let's start. Now we are going to add a new group with and we will assign a group ID as well. Uh, let's have a new group added like sudo and we'll write group add command and we'll add an option minus g and number 6000. We'll write a name v team. All right, it got added. Now what so we need to ensure that the number that we are providing here is not it is within the valid range that is defined in the slash etc slash log it dot definition file all right so all those numbers that we talk about 0 to 200 200 to 999 and 1000 plus so the 6000 range comes in 1000 plus uh, valid user ranges so if we want to add something like a, a system group uh, a, a group uh, ID within within a system group will add an option minus R how let's see that so we'll add a sudo we'll write group add and we'll add minus R and suppose they, these are applications users so we'll use app users enter so this is how we play around with group add command if you want to read more about that type group add and then minus minus health so these are the valid option minus f minus small g minus k minus o minus p minus small r that we saw and minus capital r now, what about if we need to modify group so so similar to group add we have group modify command that is group mod how we can do that all right so we have an uh, we just added a user's call a group called app users now we need to rename this or modify this to suppose uh, java app so we'll write sudo and group mod command group modify then we'll say that give a new name saying that java app and that should be given to app users group done Again, if you want to change the group ID, like we gave a 6000 ID to V team, what about six? If you want to change this, now, uh, now suppose we need to modify the group ID of some some particular groups. Like for V team, we assign a group ID of 6000, so we need to change this to 7000. So we can write sudo group mod, and we'll give a small g. And we'll write the number 7000 and it should be given to whom? V team. All right. So the V team's group ID is now changed. Now, unnecessarily, we created so many groups. I don't want these groups to exist. I want to delete them. How we can do that? So we can type group del command, that is group delete. Type sudo group del and we added Java app got deleted what about v team we also will delete v team now it also got deleted now similar to group modify command even you can modify the users all right so the members of a group are controlled with the user manager that we know already right now how to change the users primary group so it can be done using user mod command with minus small g option so we have a student let's see uh, what we have in slash etc slash pssw file so suppose for student one group is 1001 and we need to change it it's, its group name is also student one so we'll change it so we'll type sudo user mod And then small g and we'll write student one to student cool 
then what happened where a student this is our student student is assigned group id of 1001 1001 is group id for student one so this assignment taken place and we modified the users group so again you can play around with these command and you can see other options by typing uh, a user mod minus minus help and you'll get all the possible options here this tutorial help you in some way in next tutorial we'll talk about some other useful commands or concepts thanks for watching this tutorial